right, I just had my um, delivery shop. It was the slot I ordered was between um, six and eight, and it came well. And I had a text message then to say it was six thirty nine to seven o nine, and it came just before seven. So I'm just going to quickly do the first stuff so I can put it away. I'm not sitting on the floor. I had a very busy day yesterday, and I'm very achy this morning. So let's get on with the shop. Right, um, this is a fairly big one, near enough, I think, the same price as the last one. Um, but there's a few different products, and I'll explain those when I come to them. So first of all, we have got the beef joint. I know that's £6. Um, we do like the beef joint, and again, it can be cooked from frozen. Um, two lots of meatballs, um, I think they are £3 each buy two for five pounds so again they can be cooked from frozen and um, great with um, you know it's like spaghetti bolognese or something like that chicken products because I did use the last of those up during the week is the um, 60 dippers and the barbecued um, chicken strips that's usually a regular buy I did order a bag of french fries, um, we did get through one bag um, during the week and two curries, one is beef and one is chicken, um, you know just for a snack and then coming down, this is the different products here, I'm trying not to shudder it, is the Slimming World, um, I'm not sure how much these are um, I know they're a little bit more expensive than um, my normal products. Um, we've got the pork and the sausages, we've got the chips, and then we have got the um, burgers. That is due to the fact that I was hoping to have a little barbecue on Saturday, as I said, on the meal planning. And um, we're going to have our granddaughter and her mum and dad. Um, but um, I don't think it's going to happen due to weather so that's why I've bought those products so they could be um, done on the barbecue because they are on quite a strict diet um, I have got as a backup a um, mixed veg because we went to the stall on Friday and it's not there, my fruit and veg stall I don't know why, um, whether it's coming back or not um, another repeat buy is the um, two boxes of quarter pounders. I think they are now £2.50 each. And then we've got two desserts there. The family like these and said the eclairs are hubbies. Um, so as I said, I'm not sure how much um, the Slim World stuff is. It could say about £3 each, I think. Um, as you know, fries a pound. Those strips, I believe, are three, and so is the dippers. So I think that's all the prices on the freezer stuff. And as I said, I'm going to get that put away, and um, then I'll do the next category. Right, I was going to do the fridge stuff, but I've put everything else out. Um, I'll start with the drinks. Um, got um, another um, four bottles of this Pepsi Max um, as I said it is my sort of treat and the one thing that I do enjoy I am trying to minimise it and I do drink a lot of water in between but um, yeah I don't drink alcohol or anything like that so this is my little perk and as I said if I didn't have my Pepsi Max I think you know I would have a doubt you know I feel down um, also obviously caffeine um, you have to have a treat and being diabetic I know also I know it's like zero and everything no sugar but I know it's not brilliant for you but as I said let's face it most things that you like or want are not good for you but that that is my sort of um, per, you know perk do I tap, say perk yeah my treat and uh, yeah, I am slowly trying to cut it down, but as I said, if I don't have any caffeine at all, then I end up with bad heads, but uh, yeah, but I am incorporating more water. 
I have got all the cans and I just realised the iron brew is not sugar free. I'll try and get sugar free. Um, this is for the guys and I've also got Pepsi Max um, left over as well from last week. Um, I've said this before, even Hubby's started taking a, a can, a couple of cans every couple of days. Um, so she when it's hot, he has this tiny fridge just for himself that he keeps his milk in and a couple of cans of drink. Um, but like for my son, especially if he doesn't get proper breaks, um, you know, can um, just pick up a can. So he takes usually about two a day and um, it's cheaper than going obviously to a shop or even, um, you know, the garage, which is um, close by. And obviously some of those prices can be quite expensive. So I've got Iron Brew. I am not sure the prices of these. I do apologise. So we've got six cans of Iron Brew. And yes, they're not sugar free. Um, I started getting these. These, I'm sure, I can't really remember now. Was it? No, I'm not going to say what the price is because I can't remember. But this is Tango Tropical Sugar Free. And the guys love this, especially, I have not tried it. Um, maybe I'll look on the um, can at the, um, what's in it. It does say sugar free. Um, they say when this is really cold from the fridge, it's a lovely drink, especially um, when we had a barbecue and they thoroughly enjoyed the tropical. Um, but I need to um, check, the thing is, you see, um, that's why I have Pepsi Max because the caffeine. <laughs> um, like I said, and don't judge me. I know I sh shouldn't be drinking it, but it it's getting there. And obviously, I've got to have um, some perk, haven't I? I mean, it's not as though I go out that often. Um, so yeah, it's my treat. So we've got. Let's. That's enough about drinks and Pepsi Max. Um, so yeah, so we've got 12 cans of the Tango because, as I said, even our visitors enjoyed it at the weekend. Um, I have got um, the cheese slices there. I think they were a pound. They are for, obviously, we have burgers in BAPS every week, if not BLTs. I've got two lots of cheese. I think that was two packs for five pounds. I've got some bananas because our store wasn't there. Um, yeah, I could have got them from Tesco's, but I didn't. Um, they're at a pound, and I think the lettuce was either 75p or a pound, because um, I have got bacon, so um, the guys might want BLTs. Um, milk, and again, I've got those milkshakes. They're still a pound, and I say it has been cheaper than Tesco's, yeah, do excuse the state of my um, fridge. Hubby um, said about possibly going tomorrow um, to, is it Comet Curries? I always get confused and have a look because um, it is something that's drastically on our list, although I was waiting for the full lockdown to be over. Um, but yeah, we need a new fridge. It's been on our list, as I keep saying. Um, for some time so I don't know if that will be on the cards this weekend changing the subject we've got the eggs um, I only had one lot I think they're a pound but if you buy two lots I think it's something like one pound 80 but I don't need that many eggs then I've got the utterly butterly I've got the um, pepper pig um, strawberry um, from spray um, she loves these and again, it, I'm hopeful for the weekend, um, but I'm, I don't think it's going to happen, but at least it's got the 10th of July on there. So it's got, um, you know, a little bit of date if she doesn't come. As I said, I don't think the weather's that promising actually. Um, I've got some mini savoury eggs, um, you know, um, I know my son likes these. And I've just got one lot of cut meat because I've still got um, a pack left. Although I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough for the week. Um, yeah, um, so that's got the 29th of June on. Um, so it's not too bad. It's over a week, so that's not too bad on the meat. But um, yeah, we 
we tend to get through a lot of these cut meats, especially if I do um been doing a plowman's. I don't know if anybody else likes those. We do it, you know. I like it with um, cheese and salad and sometimes sausage rolls and that sort of thing. And then we've got bread products. I believe the eight wool Burton's rolls is a pound. I usually leave one out and freeze one. Um, like I said, they're a pound each. I think the wool Burton's um, bread is one pound thirty-five, one pound thirty-seven. I'd like to say Ritz, um, you know, snacky thing, a pound. And the um, scones or scones are 50 pence each. Okay, so I've got two packs of wraps. Um, they're a pound each. I'd already got the chicken. Um, because I didn't get the wraps on Tuesday, we didn't have it yesterday. Um, so we've got it today. Uh, so I already had the chicken. I've got, um, when we went into, I think Tesco's a while back with my son, um, we picked up the kits which we had the other week, but we also picked up, you know, the spice sachet for barbecue, um, smoky barbecue, I think it was, and the salsa dip. And we said all I had to do then is obviously chicken and all the trimmings, which we do anyway. So I didn't need to get the kits normally, unless I get a family one, which I did the last time, I have to um, get two boxes as it's not enough so yeah so that is the wraps and I, I'm planning to do that meal today um, over there one of Hubby's favourite I've got Skittles and those um, biscuits that the family like and yeah I do tend to um, spoil our granddaughter and I like to do a little goodie bag for her, you know, little snacky things and everything to take home. But again, I'm not sure um, whether I'll be seeing her in the garden this weekend. So we've got those LOL, LOL cakes. It could be amusing, actually, to see the guys <laughs> um, eating those. I do like the packaging, isn't it? Lovely. Very girly. And I've got other animals. But see, those things can keep. That's not a problem. Again, um, this is this is Slimming World, and usually I would have something like that. I think they're allowed those. Um, we had the strawberry ones, and Harvey, I didn't didn't think he would. I put his back in up, and he loved it. He says, "Oh, I like those." There isn't any more, and I didn't purchase any more because I went for the toffee and chocolate ones. So I hope he likes those. But they're on offer for a pound. Um, I'm not sure how much they are normally. But these are like one ninety five, And obviously this is why um, I'm not moaning. This is in Slimming World. And this is why my shopping went on. So I wanted a dessert because um, one had a little bit of ice cream. The, the other one wasn't because um, of the strict diet. But this is the Rocky Road one. Reminds me. I'm not having to that look nice. And I say, if I didn't mention it, I'm a bit slow this morning. Um, one, I think they were one ninety five, as that is a pound. So yeah. And then again, I've had all the different ones. We've got the yogurt cranberries this week. I tried these. I know I shouldn't. They're very sweet, but it's something you know to snack on. Every time I purchase something like this, especially these yogurt cranberries. You know, I shouldn't say it, it reminds me of Christmas because we always have these at Christmas along with, you know, peanuts and um, cashew nuts and things like that. So, yeah. Um, so there we are. So that concludes my food shop. And now I'm going to go and put it away. So um, hopefully you've enjoyed this um, video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.